Hello, this is a small series about creating a small application visualizing how a helicopter does fly. In this episode I'm going to mention how I created the movement script, the camera script and finally I also decided to implement the possibility for the helicopter to land. After a few trial and error attempts, I managed to create a movement script that is um, usable. The camera script was also interesting because I didn't want the camera to be part of the helicopter. I wanted the camera to follow the helicopter, but also that the camera stays on the very same position considering the horizon. But it is also turning around with the helicopter. And I decided to take a uh, angle a little bit sideways and to focus it not to the center of the helicopter but a little bit sideways. Because it is a small side project, I won't invest more time in this option. After having programmed the possibility to steer this helicopter, I totally forgot something. I forgot the possibility to land the helicopter, so I improvised. I created a plane with in Unity. I gave this plane a box collider. I also could have given it a plane collider in this scenario here. In other projects I had to modify the FBX file to be writable in order to use mesh colliders. So I'm sometimes just used to use box colliders and I didn't care here. However, here we see some bugs. So, if this helicopter is near a surface which has a collider, it will automatically get into a vertical position and the maneuver possibilities are being set lower. Also here I forgot that it could be possible for the helicopter to land on some slightly clinated polygons, but here I'm just assuming that we have horizontally aligned flat polygons to land on. Let's also have a look on the new version of the code of this application. For the next episode I'm thinking about creating a mesh collider or capsule collider for the helicopter per se and to create a mock level in order to test the helicopter in an environment or I could try to create a cockpit view. I'm still thinking about it. Okay, um, thanks for watching.